So, so we're supersetting uh, just uh, standing alternating dumbbell curls with these kind of uh, kind of like a modified uh, preacher seat preacher seat uh, cable curl. And what it is is uh, a lot of a lot of a lot of times people seem to have difficulty just getting a good uh, contraction. Seems like on the preacher curl because at the top, I have the same issue. Uh, I kind of thought it was just me, but we were talking about it. You guys the same problem. Is seems like you kind of lose. Uh, you had a disadvantage at the top, and you lose the leverage. Uh, you actually have too much leverage, and you don't really feel it. And you have to kind of adjust your body to really feel that the concentric portion of the of the movement at the top. Uh, so it's just really taxing on the lower end, really getting a good uh, bicep stretch. But at the top, uh, a lot of people can't really feel the contraction. So what I do here sometimes to, to change it up is uh, it's kind of like the same angle as a preacher curl, if you will. But I just kind of sit down, sit back on my heels. You're not going to fall over because the weight here is going to counterbalance you as you do this exercise. Um, if you're trying to hit the long head of your bicep, you're just going to kind of bring your feet in and have your elbows tighter and hit your long head. If you're trying to hit the short head, you kind of go more out with your elbows, but you hit more inside the bicep. So the reason why this is so much better is you get more of a constant tension throughout the whole movement because it's on a cable constantly pulling against you, not just going down with the force of gravity. So you have the force of gravity, but you also have the cable is pulling back the whole time so and if I need to feel it more I can, or if I need to spot myself I can even sit back more to kind of get a little bit more leverage and pull back but if I don't I can just sit here and right at the top I feel a, just a really 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 good contraction in the top portion of the movement better than, I'll, than I've ever felt doing it with a free weight bar so it's just something different. So you guys are kind of looking for a new preacher seat uh, curl. Try it. Try it like this. Sit down. It gets a little. It takes a get, little getting used to at first. It's different, but it would really help to build a peak on your bicep and uh, just to get a better, better contraction throughout the whole, throughout the whole exercise. It's constant tension. It's constantly pulling. Uh, on your bicep. Nice. You see, I'm almost spent. I've only done like five or six reps. So. Oh, I saw you do like a hundred more pounds than that. So That's a mean shari, the natural. Total beast. No, this is a great exercise. Huge pump. I've never seen this before. So thanks to me just for showing us. If you're uh, bored on your biceps, this is a sweet exercise to do. And uh, if you're not flexible, don't be afraid because this will kind of counterbalance your uh, falling forward or falling backwards. Yeah, I start right here. Just kind of move back. Get a little bit more out of it. Look at that. Nice. All right, thanks to me.